Okay, so I'm kind of sorry, but um, I had to stop the last video because I accidentally turned off my tablet. So, yeah. Um, but this is what we got to last time is pulling about pulling apart our cotton balls. And yeah, so now I'm going to work on getting the paper. So what you want to do is kind of just trim off the edges. So like that. It's the first one. And then just kind of just trim off the corners of the paper. All four sides. And then just trim it down to shape. So kind of just test it out by putting the cotton stuff you're filling onto the paper and kind of like cut it down a little bit. And yeah, so I'm just gonna cut down this side and then try to form it. So then what you wanna do is just kind of get it all together, like balled up however you're gonna want it, and then just kind of try to fold it however you're gonna want it, so I'll kind of give them like the taco shape like before. And then you can just trim off the excess paper that you don't want. So I'm trimming mine about here. Okay. So right now it just looks like a giant taco actually. Um, but yeah. So kind of just trim it down. Try not to cut the cotton like I almost just did. Um, but yeah, get it all kind of balled up and then cut off the extra so that you kind of get the shape that you want. And then once again, if there's any extra, make sure to cut it off now before your final result. So I'm cutting off the side. yeah so this is kind of how mine looks right now I'm gonna kind of clean up a little bit and yeah then I'll show you guys the next step okay so after you are done with that you are going to need some tape and I am just going to and then you just have to tape off the sides like this just so that none of the foam or any of the filling can escape so I'm just going to do this, probably not going to talk much because you kind of get the idea, you just tape off the edges, and yeah, so I'm not going to talk any more than this, and yeah, so just watch if you want to. Oh yeah, make sure to push the foam or any of the cotton down if you are right close to taping it. And yeah, just make sure to do that so that you don't tape any of that. And then if you have any extra pieces, like this part right here, you can just like fold it over and then tape that part down with some extra tape just to make sure you don't have any like loose edges. Okay, so then when you're done, it should look something like this with all of the edges taped. And yeah, and then now comes the fun part, which is customizing it. And make sure you squish it just to make sure it's squishy as you want. 
and otherwise you can add more stuff inside, but I, mine is good with just five. So um, make sure the tape actually isn't too tight either, because that is a problem that I've run into, and yeah, it's not really that great. So anyways, now I'm going to pause and get to a good angle to show you guys my decorating. Okay, um, so I'm going to make this into kind of a smiley face. So, let's do one eye. This is kind of hard to do to hold the camera, and yeah. So, anyways, um, you kind of get the idea, just decorate it however you want. I'm just going to add some eyes and a smile. And yeah, so I'm going to actually just set this down and pause it because otherwise it might take. Okay, so this is the finished squishy after it was decorated. Kind of just added some eyelashes and some dots and stars just to fill in some empty spaces. And yeah, so this is my finished squishy and I'll show you guys kind of this one and then the other one kind of next to each other and yeah. So that's kind of the ending, but yeah. So anyways, let me get that set up. Um, all right, so now this is the first one I made. Kind of more boring, but um, yeah, then this is the new one. And I'm planning on making a few of these. And yeah, so if you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe. And yeah, so I will s see everybody in the next video. Bye!